Good morning everyone. As you can see this is HP 15S-FQ2037 and a model laptop. It's a 15 inch laptop and now it shows system fan error which is 90B4 Bravo. Means the actual CPU cooling fan is faulty so we're going to replace it. So I'm going to show you how to replace that for this model. Most of the 15 inch laptop from HP does have similar sort of fan but not exact same but the procedure is same so first of all you need to order a replacement fan if you do have this sort of error message you can choose it from eBay you can get it quite cheap and easy to get it okay so first of all we're gonna take those uh, screws out from the actual back plate and before we order check not only the model number of your laptop also you need to check the unique model number from the faulty fan okay most of the time they do printed model number for each and every parts and component so try to do that otherwise you're going to end up with different model okay so let's take out all the screws as you can see there was a rubber strip to hide all the screws so make sure you pull the rubber strip carefully and then take out all the screws i don't like this design from hp because this one makes things more complicated a lot of people even doesn't feel there is any sort of screw hidden underneath this rubber pad okay and when you put it back that's also kind of problem because this one does have elasticity effect so when you pull it it stretch out and when you try to put it back you see it doesn't fit in but if you leave it for a couple of hours it's gonna squeeze in and you can put it back normally so first of all switch it off take out all the screws pull the back cover off disconnect the battery and then take out all the screws from the cooling fan and then you can carry out this replacement so when you have faulty cpu fan if you replace the fan that would not solve the problem why because if the fan faults is going on for a couple of months and you are constantly using your laptop that might dry out the actual thermal paste okay and that thermal paste need to replace it so we're going to cover up both in this video hopefully you will enjoy the rest of the video and if you do like if you do have any question leave it in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe